Five shifts. We're going out to Dunn, North Carolina today to go hunt a public field that's just a pay to hunt field. It's $20 a person. It's out on a Chris Weeks land out in Dunn, North Carolina. They set me up in like this spot in the middle of the field that I didn't want to be at, but I got it anyways. And I'm like, all right, we're going to work with what we got. We had some really good cloud cover going in the morning. It always plays a factor. It's a hit or a miss. Penny and Avery in the field with us working these birds. Avery is mine. She is two years old. It takes a lot to be able to work them in the situation under this high stress environment and make sure that they're gonna perform. It's the tuning block. This is where we find out if it's gonna be a hit or a miss this year. And hopefully they're gonna come through. The sun finally did peak out right around 10, 30, 11 o'clock. It gave us about an hour of shooting light as far as getting the doves to move and pushing them across the field and making them kind of get up out of the fields and find that shade. Day two, you when know, I went over to my buddy Tommy's house, post F Phillip. He scouted it the day prior, in the afternoon prior, and had a ton of doves over there in the afternoon. So we figured we'd try it over there. On day two, I brought Penny out there. She was the only dog out there that day. Um, Penny's my two-year-old yellow lab. Nine months, she picked up uh, 68. Last season, she picked up 108. So hopefully this season, she continues doing really, really well. So we waited till probably about 10.30, still fog super thick. So we decided to head to the house and try an afternoon. Went over there in the afternoon. Um, ended up being pretty good right off the bat. There was a ton of doves flying around when we first got there. Um, started shooting, just killed a few birds. Wow. I got that one. That was sick. That was deep. Wow. Marshman. <laughs> 